All right, hey, what's up guys, Gratuitous here. Welcome to my new course on how to use the number pad inside of FL Studio. So the number pad is a tool that I have used for many years and it is essential to my fast workflow. Now, if you're ever gonna be buying like a laptop, I always recommend buying a laptop that has a number pad. If you're gonna be using that laptop for FL Studio, it's just gonna really help your workflow. And if you don't, you can always buy like, a, you know, a USB pad that is, uh, you know, like a number pad that's USB. Um, but then you always have to kind of like bring it around with you. And it's just, it's just like a little bit of knowing, right? Uh, but in this course, what we're going to do is we are actually going to walk through FL Studio and I'm going to break down, you know, the number pad here and reveal to you how I use it to flow so fast instead of FL Studio. And just to confirm, so when I say the number pad, I am talking this. So some people think the minus and the plus is the same thing and it's not inside of FL Studio. So the number pad is a super special tool, okay? I'm going to walk you through how I use it for fast workflow. And I've actually broken this course down into two different uh, kind of sections. So when I'm actually making a beat, I use the number pad a little bit differently. And then when I get into the, the arrangement and mixing, I use the number pad again a little bit differently. So I kind of break this course down into two different sections. It's not a long course, but it's going to be a course that will be really revealing to you for a fast workflow and seeing how I use it inside of FL Studio. So if you're interested, enroll, and I'll teach you guys how to use this number pad for a fast workflow inside of FL Studio. 